Hi, this is Dan with Basements101.com. Recently I've been getting lots of questions about split outlets and how they work. Or mainly the questions I've been getting is I've got two wires going to an outlet and one of them does not work. So, let me see if I can explain this so it makes sense. This is just a regular outlet and what I've got is I've got two black wires going into it on the hot side and a couple of whites on the neutral side. Now, one of the most important things to know about this outlet is it has a little tab. I don't know if you can see it, but the little tab is right here in the middle of these two screws, and that's called a breakaway tab. What that's for is normally the current is going to flow into one side of the outlet, this side of the outlet, across the screw, and out the other side of the outlet. If that tab is still there, then the current can come, on, come in, go across, and come back out that way. If that tab is still there, then both sides of the outlet are going to work. You'll have power going to both sides. Now, this little tab is called a breakaway tab because what you can do is when it's wired, this small tab, little brass tab here on top, hope you can see it, that can be removed. You can take that off with a pair of pliers, this little tab right here. When you remove that, you no longer have a connection from this side to this side so if the power is coming in on this side, only this side of the outlet will get power. This side will not get power because there's no way to take the current through to it. Also, anything that's connected to this line, the next so socket or whatever outlet, may not receive power. Now, a lot of times people have a problem because this breakaway tab is off and they've got a switch somewhere. So when they flip the switch, what they're doing is they're sending power to this side of the socket. Now that's normal in most homes. They'll put a, an outlet in your house that you can turn on and off with a switch. But it may only be one side of the outlet. It may be this side and not this side. When you remove the breakaway tab, the power doesn't go through. But if the breakaway tab is still there, then the power continues to flow. So, with that said, if you're having problems with one side of the outlet or the other in your house, or if you've just wired an outlet, and only one side works and the other side doesn't work, what you want to do is you want to check and see if this tab is still in place. If that little tab is gone, then the power is not going across. Now, another thing to keep in mind, and this is important, is this wire right here, the hot wire coming into the outlet, if the breakaway tab is gone, this line could come from a switch and this line could be hot all the time. So if you've got an outlet, this side works all the time, and this side does not work all the time, check for a switch for this side. If the switch is, if the switch is on, you're going to have power on this side. This side, if this is a hot line coming in from the circuit, this side may be live all the time. So you may have power on this side and no power on this side. If you have no power on one side, Check to see if the breakaway tab is broken off and then look for a switch that controls this side of the circuit.